this way, guys. Come and stand in front of me. Bring the trophy with you. Come and stand just here, fellas. Bring that trophy because it is very much all yours. Wow, you've done it. The Global Champions for Worth! <laughs> Peter Bot, I'm going to come to you first. How does it feel to officially confirm Global Champion? It means the world to me. I mean, we knew we were going to win coming into it, and we're the best duo in the world. Poyo, the trophy is yours. It has been an incredible year. Tell us exactly what's going through your mind right now as well. Um, I mean, this is amazing. Like, we want, we got second the first major, and then win, win, win. It's 3P. We heard you earlier on the comms say, greatest in the world, baby. Is that what it feels like right now? You've proved it on this main stage. Yeah, yeah, we are the greatest in the world. I will say that for sure. It's been an incredible 2024 for you guys. Back-to-back -back majors, the global championship as well. It feels unstoppable. How has your experience been this weekend? Everything play out as you planned. I mean, you came into this with such confidence, Poya. Yeah, I think we were going to win. Like, the, the first few games at the start of this day didn't go as like, planned, but it ended up working in the end. I'm going to ask as well here, you were really pushed to the limits there. You came in strong today. A bit more difficult, but you managed to ride through what the experience of this year and those major titles as well. That's really what feels like got you here as well, to confirm officially greatest in the world. 3P. We got a 3P now. I'm going to ask one last time as well uh, for you guys, uh, Poyo. What do you want to say to the fans out there? I mean, Fort Worth, make some noise one more time. The fans there, everyone watching at home. Anything you want to say to them down the camera right now, just say, what do you feel? You and Peter Vault right here. Uh, thank you for everyone being here. My family's here as well. Thank you to them. Thank you for being here. Peter Vault, same for me. One more time, Fort Worth. Would you please put your hands together and give it up for your FNCS and Global Champions 2024, Peter Vault and Poyer. Gentlemen, <laughs> take a deep breath. I don't need a deep breath. <laughs> you don't need a deep breath. I love it. Guys, I want you to just bask in that for a moment. You've done it. You set an unbelievable record in Major 2. You back to back in Major 3. And then you take it that one step further. A global championship title. Oh, bro, let's go, dude. <laughs> Poyo. You said you're here with your family. How does it feel, man, to know you're a global champion? You've worked so hard all year long. Your family is here. NA is here with you. Fort Worth is here with you. Dig deep, tell me, how does it feel? It feels amazing. I mean, last year, I didn't do like as good as I wanted. So now winning, it feels even better. And then with the fans, my family being here, it makes it even better. Peter Bot, same question, brother. Dig deep. Let me know. How's it feeling? I mean, I have like 20 family members in the crowd right now. Let's go. Feels the world, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> awesome stuff, guys. Listen, uh, it's, it's hard because you guys have broken records throughout the entirety of the year, almost every single one that has ever existed. You guys got second, first, first. Now you went on the international stage. I guess the question for me is, are your eyes or your goals set on anything else? Like, have you done it all? Do you want to go further? Do you want to just keep winning? Well, where are we going? Uh, I mean, you can only just keep winning. Peter? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I think we're gonna win three out of three next year and oh. the Globals next year, too. <laughs> wow. There Imagine that. Imagine that. Look, Poyo, you burst onto the scene last year. I remember you were trying out with Boob. Everyone said, who's this kid? Poyo, where's he coming from? NA West, what on earth is going on? Your rise has been incredible, and of course, 
understandably everyone looks at Peter and goes, this guy's the best in the world, but for you to have achieved what you've achieved the past two years, right? Talk to him about how you've done that and, and, and advice you'd give to young up and coming talent who want to do what you've done. Yeah, so I got a good teammate, Sphinx. We ended up getting third, fifth. We got a coach that really helped us. So from that, and then I played with Peter. So then, then we won. So to, to the people like out there that want to play, just just play, like just play every day and then just watch, watch people, watch pros, watch your mistakes as well. Guys, I want you to take a moment here. I just want you to just look around this stadium. Look at all of these fans standing up for you guys. They are here with you in this moment. You have created a moment in FNCS history that we will remember forever. What do you guys want to say to these fans, to the fans at home who are watching and want to aspire to do what you do, who are literally yelling your name the same way these fans here have been yelling? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. It's, it's home court advantage. The fans, you guys are amazing. And uh, I appreciate all you guys for uh, coming out and uh, watching. Oh, yeah. Same thing. Absolutely fantastic. Fort Worth, one more time, give it up for your global champions! <laughs> guys, thank you so much. Grab your trophy, get out of here, go celebrate. <laughs> we'll take those headsets from you. Guys, bro. Hey. That's right, go on. One more time, Dickie's Arena! Let them hear it! Man, <laughs> Vivid, Levin, what do we even say? What else could we say about this duo? They have not allowed us to talk about anybody else. We've tried. We have tried, and yet every step of the way, they have stolen the spotlight, and now they walk away as global champions. I mean, being closely associated with the NAFNCS throughout the year, there were doubts every single major for this duo to win it. Yeah, the first one, they got second. But every single time they prove everybody wrong, and Levin was talking about it. I mean, there there were huge doubts coming into the global championship this year. Oh, Peter Bot not going to be as good in person. Well, I think this performance has shut everybody else up. I have no idea what negative things you could have to say about this duo. They seem unstoppable. I think everyone's pretty much established that yes, these guys are the best team in the world. Forget about that. They are the best team of all time. There wow. has never been a duo this good. Speaking of individuals, of course, the big man, Skinny P, there has never been a player that good. Nobody has reached the levels he has shown us this weekend. The way he played, I don't know if anybody ever will. This guy is a different gravy. This duo is a different level. And I can't wait to see what the future holds for them, man. This is special. Just to think as well, I mean, Peter Bot, it's crazy to think about it, you know. He is just this star, but behind every star, there's always that player to help him shine brighter. Pollo, it didn't matter the situations. He was always right there with Peter Bot. In those situations where it looked bleak, I mean, even in that last game, Peter Bot gets absolutely cracked and is recoiling, and Pollo is there instantly. Here's the med kit. Get back in the fight. This is the last game. We must win. Sometimes it's hard to visualize. Sometimes it's hard to quantify, right? Just looking at the pure statistics. But these type of performances from Peter Bot were not happening before teamed up with Poyo. There is something special about the chemistry of this duo. And why it may not always be obvious, it is definitely there. Absolutely. I mean, <laughs> honestly, these guys are, are, are the blueprint going forward. I think everybody sort of had conversations after that first major two dominance of is this the future? Do you put two crazy fraggers next to each other and try and get them to figure out the game? I think we'll see a lot more duos in this mold being formed for years to come. Just fantastic stuff, Levin. I, I have a question for you. Uh, you like to say that EU is on top, but how many FNCS Global Championship <laughs> titles does EU have? Go on. Go on. How many Global Championship titles 
does NA have? David, you were wearing a shirt yesterday. What was on that shirt again? NA on top. Hey, what do you got to say about that, big man? Hey, man, 2024 has been NA's year. Absolutely. And I mean, no better duo you could have had than this one to, to, to be leading the charge for your region. I want to say a big props, of course. Everyone's going to, you know, give Peter Bottom Poyo the praise. Absolutely. They deserve it. A lot of people expected it to be a blowout coming into the Global Championships of how good they've been. But Queasy and Thomas, to have pushed it to the limit, honestly, I, I can't even believe Thomas has come second again. <laughs> you know, Queasy <laughs> I know. on the global stage to come second again. It, it hurts. It hurts me. It will hurt them. But props to them for just how good they've been and, and at least pushing us to the final game. That was something many people would have never expected to happen. So props to them and the rest of the EU boys filling up that top five, not top five, top six. The rest of the EU boys filling up that top six. Super impressed by all of them. Yeah, I mean, we obviously have to give Queasy Thomas flowers, right? They were the only duo. The moment Peter Bayon Boyle started to pull away, they were the only duo that could hang. And it came down to the wire there. If their loadout had been just a little bit different, this could have been just infinitely changed um to see you know obviously viv i would have loved to see just like invitational and he knew what he was doing <laughs> but still to have just an amazing run and of course three hundred thousand dollars you have to be proud of this duo yeah i mean i can almost guarantee you that they're going to be heartbroken even though second place is incredible and we do have to point out the fact that yeah we came into day number two or maybe even the global championships as a whole being like peter bot and player they're going to run away with it it's not even going to be close but queasy and thomas they gave us that race they were very very close they were applying the pressure to peter bot and Poyo, and that alone deserves its own recognition look I i've been handing out feature a second ago and was talking about moments right one of the moments I mentioned involved Queasy two years ago at the Invitational. He is now a part of, again, one of the best moments we have had in Fortnite history. This is the best IJ of all time, the greatest IJ of all time. Again, he might not be happy hearing that. Now all he would have been caring about is the chip winning the championship. But give Queasy his flowers. Goat status. That's right. I mean, and, and of course, just a, a massive reminder, these are the 50 best duos in the world for Fortnite. If your favorite duel maybe did not, you know, win or walk away in the placement that even they thought was worthy of winning or walking away, please go find them on socials. Go send them love. They are one of the 50 best duos in the world. And they competed and left everything on that stage for you at home, for everyone here in this arena and for Fortnite history. It's been an incredible year. 2024 closes out with a bang. Global Championship delivered. We were jumping up here on the stage. We were screaming. There's probably been some voices lost throughout the arena. I'm shout sure. out to the Fortnite fam and everybody associated with the competition. And a big shout out to the competitors for keeping it clean throughout 12 games. You guys delivered. Thank you for the show. And one big congratulations to Peter Bot and Poyo. Oh, echo what Vivid said there, man. Put it perfectly. This has been one of my favorite events of all time. It's been special. I can't wait for what the future holds. For all of these players walking off the stage now, they've been great. I hope to see all of them back in the future. That's right. Fortnite fam, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for allowing us to live this crazy dream of bringing 50 duels from around the world to compete for a title of global champions. It has been an honor and a pleasure, and we look forward to hanging out with you more in 2025. From these fantastic people, from Mini Miner, from Kelly Link, from Monster DeFace, from The Best Taco, and Adam Savage, we look forward to seeing you in 2025. Until then, we love you, keep yourself safe, and we'll see you on that battle bus.